Hey guys, what's up? All right, well, this video is a perfect example of why you shouldn't keep your money at the bank. Uh, when the money's at the bank, it's not your money, it's their money. And uh, if they don't want to give it to you, they're not going to give it to you. So, and I've had this problem in the past. I tried to withdraw a large sum of my money, of money I had in my account that I needed. And uh, they said, no, we can't do it, sorry. Well, you have to wait, you have to order the money. You have to order the money uh, and it'll be here next week. Are, are you f kidding me? Next week? I need it t tomorrow. Anyways, and then on top of that, you gotta fill out uh, IRS forms or tax form, all this stuff. It's like, it's my money. What, what the hell is it, any of the government's business what I'm doing with my money that I withdraw? You know, they wanna know well, why they need it. Well, none of your fucking business why I need my money. I'm going to go fucking buy a bunch of cocaine and hookers. That's why I need it. And I have a gambling problem. So, anyways, <laughs> that's what I put on the forum too. Ah, what are you going to do? So, anyways, today I'm trying to cash a large check. Um, it's for, uh, and it's not from a private party. It's from a large city. It's from the city of Los Angeles. And the, the check is over over ten thousand dollars well i need the money because i'm gonna go spend it tomorrow and uh i already went to one b of a and they told me oh sorry we can't cash that i'm like what are you talking about you can't cash that isn't this a bank yeah but we have limits we can only give you 10 and then you have to wait uh till tomorrow to get another five uh if you want to withdraw it i'm like no i need the all the money now because tomorrow I'm going somewhere and they got to buy something. Well, we can't do that. I said, why not? I said, aren't you a bank? What do you mean? You got to order the money. Well, I, I said, you got a safe in here, don't you? A big giant safe. What do, you, what do you have in the safe? It's a bank. Don't you have, well, we have limits. Well, why do you have limits on my money? It's my money. Give me my money. So anyways, I said, forget it. I'm going to go to the, the bank that I normally use uh, and hopefully... You know they know me well enough that they could do that but I may have to order order this money and pick it up another day which is ridiculous uh, so anyways screw the banks keep your money at your house <laughs> bury it you know do something with it hide it like they did in the old days when they didn't trust the banks and uh, and that's your best bet the only money you should keep in a bank Let's say if you have, like I do, um, where you pay your bills online, or you, you have online banking. I only keep enough in my, my account to uh, pay my bills. That's it. Pay my bills and maybe a few hundred extra bucks for, you know, whatever, if I, my daughter needs some money. or There's no reason to keep your money at the bank. You're not making any money on it. Uh, you know, the chance someone's going to come in your house and rob you and break into your secret hiding stash are a million to one come on we don't need freaking banks these sons of bitches all they do is they they, they kill you with fees and taxes etc and that's the way they keep track of you they know how much money you're bringing in how much money you're bringing out and then when you take out a certain amount they want to know what what you're going to use it for well it's none of your fucking business what i'm going to use my money for uh, okay so I'm almost at the bank. I'm going to strap up with a chest harness on this camera. And uh, I'm going to see if they ask questions about that. But I'm going to try and cash it over here. All right, guys. Stand by. Keep watching. Uh, don't forget to hit, uh, hit the like button. And subscribe to my channel, please. Uh, subscribing does nothing. It doesn't hurt you. It doesn't cost you any money. But I, I need you guys to subscribe because uh, I need to get to 1,000 uh, subscribers in order for uh, that... Uh, YouTube to monetize me again because they demonetized me due to their new rules. All right, uh, stand by. Here we go. Hello. I'd like to cash this, please. So 
for this amount sir it has to be joined for deposit we cannot cash the whole amount we don't carry that much cash we can do less cash back but not the whole thing isn't this a bank i'm sorry isn't this a bank though don't you have money here i mean it's yes, a... but we don't carry fifteen thousand for each you don't have fifteen thousand in this bank not for everybody yeah, we cannot... not for everybody yeah i mean not everybody if we're withdrawing fifteen thousand we're not going to be able to have well how money. many so people have you had people. how many people have withdrawn fifteen thousand today not even so, it's so not i'm even just the only one so what is the most that you want to take it today? 15,000. But we cannot do it. Okay, can your manager like override that? I can check for her. Thanks. I've been a customer here for probably 20, 23 years, 25 years. Yeah, we would have to order, but we are going to get a shipment for tomorrow if you need to pick it all at once. Okay, that's so, but for today, I can only take t 10. Yeah, yeah, we're running short today. I'll so just pick it up all tomorrow. Pick it all tomorrow? Okay. Yeah. Just make sure to come after 4 30 because that's when the shipment comes in. I can't do after 4 30. I have to, I'm going to purchase a, something tomorrow and I need all the money like in the morning. You're, well, yeah, but it has to be up. Oh, wait, no. Yeah, you should be able to do it in the morning. Yeah, okay. That's fine. Yeah. So, should I bring that back tomorrow morning then? Well, you should probably just deposit it so it's available in your account for tomorrow. Because we still always run the risk of us not being. Oh, okay, able to but you're still. So tomorrow I'm going to be able to withdraw that 15. Yeah. Because you're going to order it for me. No, I'm not going to order it. I'm going to get another delivery that I'm getting tomorrow. So I'll be able to give you what they're getting for tomorrow. It's too late to order it but, today. I mean, can we'll you. We'll have the money available for you for Okay, because I don't want another teller to tell me, like, oh, we can only give you 10. You know. Ask for me, sir. I'm the manager. What's your name? My name is Rosa. Rosa. Okay. And then I'll take care of it for you. Just be aware that we do have to fill out documentation for you, okay? okay. So what's, the, what's the documentation for? It's whenever you're withdrawing this much in cash. So we what, need to what's the documentation for, though? What is that? It's, we need to report that you're withdrawing this much in cash. Report that to who? To the bank and to other... Um, it just goes to the bank and then they... I mean, you... you why would you report to the bank when I'm here? You, you've seen that I'm putting it out. You're pulling it out of the we, account. For this dollar amount, we do report Thank that you're you withdrawing this much money out. For AML yeah, compliance. To who? For AML compliance, we do submit What's AML? It. I could give you the paperwork. I, I'm, I'm just curious because, I, I mean, I thought you were... I'll give you the paperwork. I want to know who you're reporting it to. I mean, you guys know that I'm taking it, right? Who else are you reporting it to? I'll give you the paperwork for it. You don't know who you're reporting it to? It's for the uh, anti-money laundering. Oh, so, oh okay. That's all you had to say. I don't know what AML stands for. Well, I didn't know if you were going to tell me. Uh, you didn't know what anti-money laundering is, so that's. I know what anti-money laundering is, yeah, but I didn't okay, know what so AML you stands want us for. To deposit this I'll just bring it back tomorrow morning when okay, I. Okay, so then we run the chance that the system might not let us cash it because it's not a Bank okay, of America check. Okay, then deposit. Yeah, so that way we know for sure the money will be available for okay. you. Okay, so anti-money laundering—that's under. The, the government that's or something? There's all this money that's being... Um, you know, right, I understand yeah. what anti-laundering, money laundering is, but that's reported to the government? Oh, I it can be, yes. I'm going to okay. 51. So they want to know what we're doing with our money? Correct. Well, what do these forms consist of? What do I have to fill out? They will have your social security address, occupation, and... Um, and what I'm going to use the money for? No. They don't want to know why I'm going to use the money? No. Okay. Which account would you like to deposit? 5069? Now, can I go to any bank or I have to come to this yeah, one? We're ordering it. We're going to save it for you, so you okay. have to come to this one. Okay. And you open at 9? We open at 9. Yes. Okay. Thank you, Rosa. Mm -hmm. you just have to sign the oh, I'm sorry. Okay, perfect. Right. Okay, thanks. Okay, so it's not asking for a hold or anything, so it'll be available tomorrow, so that one when you come, it's available, okay? Great, thank you, Rosa. Thank you. You'll be here tomorrow? I'll be here tomorrow, okay. yeah. Thank you. Uh -huh. Thank you. Thank you. Bye-bye. Okay. 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 Hmm. And there you have it. And there you have it. Well, okay, there you have it. Um... Uh, I'm not done with this yet. Um, like you heard, I got to come back tomorrow. But was it just me or did she become pretty uh, defensive when I asked, who do you report it to? 
and uh, and then I asked her, well, you know, does it get reported to the government? She says, well, it can be. Well, uh, of course it is. The bank already knows I'm withdrawing the money. It's coming out of their computer, so they know that. So uh, why do I get to fill out forms? So so they know again on paper that I did. It's in their computer. <coughs> and then with the AML thing, it's like, okay, AML. Well, I know what money laundering is. Well, I don't know what bank a- acronyms are. The hell, AML. I'm like, what's AML? Uh, anti money Well, I didn't know what she goes. I didn't know that you would know what anti money money laundering means. And I, and I'm thinking to myself, so I know what AML means, what, what, dumbass. Anyways, and then I asked her, if you listen closely, I asked her, well. Um, do I, I said so the government needs to know what I'm doing with money, huh? And she goes, "Well, uh, what was it? Something like, yeah." And I go, "Well, what the form? What does the form consist of?" And she goes, "Well, your social security number, your name, blah blah blah." And I said, "Well, do I also have to provide a reason why I need the money?" And she goes, "No." I said, "So they don't want to know why I'm using it?" No. Well, I'm calling bullshit now, and we'll see tomorrow when I pick up the money. But last time I did fill out these forms, they one of the main things on that form was reason why I'm withdrawing that amount of money. And, and that's when I put for cocaine hookers and gambling debt. So she's lying, and we'll, we'll see that tomorrow. Uh, I'm going to strap up again tomorrow when I go get the money. And... Uh, and then it'll be on video. Okay, anyways, to some of you, this is no big deal. To me, it is. Uh, Don't keep your money in a freaking bank. They're fucking crooks. Um, Government is corrupt. And, uh, you know, they want to know everything you fucking do. Uh, They eavesdrop on you. The NSA eavesdrops on you. They know everything you say and do all the time. And, uh, you know, that's the way it is. We'll see if this, uh, this video doesn't even get banned, you know because they don't want anybody talking out about anything. Uh, You know, Alex Jones was banned. Uh, uh, A whole bunch of other YouTubers were banned for uh, saying things they don't like. So freedom of speech is shit nowadays. And uh, you are shit. You, you are shit to this government. You're just a fucking slave, right? Starting from uh, them taking half your paycheck. Did, did anybody else see uh, the government working next to you at work uh, for half your time to be able to take half your fucking money so they can give it to other countries so they could spend it on trillion dollars worth of uh, 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 munitions for, you know, countless wars? We've been at war for, Jesus Christ, look at the statistics on how long the U.S. has been at war. Pretty much the whole time we've been a country, we've been at war with someone. I think there's like 20 years that we haven't been at war out of 200 plus years. So anyways, guys, smarten up. (laughs) I love you guys. All right. Hey, uh, just so you know, I decided to make this two part video, uh, because I think it's going to be too long. It takes forever to do, uh, uh, download and upload and all that crap. Um, so it's a two part video. Don't forget to watch part two. I'm going to put a little pop-up window you can click on for part two. And I'm going to do part two tomorrow and post it tomorrow. And uh, again, guys, please uh, hit the like button. And uh, hit most importantly, hit the subscribe button. I'm trying to make, I'm trying to hit a 1,000 subscribers uh, so I can get monetized again because they demonetized me uh, with their new policies. And, uh, you know, I don't make a lot of money uh, from YouTube, but... Uh, the 80 to 100 and something bucks I do make uh, I'll pay for fuel to get around to places that I go to or stuff like that alright hey thanks again and uh, again watch part 2